I'm today in the pouring rain, but this is the kind of thing that us expeditioners do when we're out on the prowl looking for sites of interest. I'm in Eastry itself, which is in Kent. Um, this has a very interesting link to the town, the city I should say, of Faisalabad, which used to be named Lailpur, because the founder of that city, the one who planned that city, James Broadwood Lyle, he's actually buried here. And it's actually pouring down with rain, it's been raining all afternoon. But I was here and I thought I've got to capture uh, his gravesite, I've got to get the um, footage for it. Now I'll try just walking over to, to the grave if I can hopefully get some of the uh, footage on here. And it's uh, quite enclosed and it's got on here. So this is his wife, um, Catherine Lyle. Uh, it says also of Catherine Lyle, wife of Sir James Broadwood Lyle. But it's got on this front round here, because they're both buried here. So it's got James Lyle's here. So it says in loving memory of Sir James Broadwood Lyle, Eastry, born 4th of March 1838, does that say? Died 4th of December 1916 at rest. So this is his actual grave site the place of burial. It's pouring down with rain. This is what I put myself through to try and capture the footage. Now the city of Faisalabad itself, of Lailpur itself, has a lot of famous residents, a lot of famous people have been uh, born in uh, the city. A couple of the cricketers I can think of, Ramiz Raja, um, also Saeed Ajmal was born there as well. Poetry wise, Naqsh Lailpuri, Bhagat Singh was also born there and I featured a video uh, where I went to his uh, birthplace and his uh, house in uh, Banga in uh, Faisalabad. Also I can think of um, other luminaries as well, uh, Ustad Nasir Fateh Ali Khan who was born in Faisalabad. One of the up and coming, I should say, he's not up and coming, he's been there for a while but I consider him one of the more younger up and coming comedians, Sakaf Naz, he was also born in the city itself. But that city is quite famous being the first planned city um, in uh, India itself at the time, British India as it was known. Uh, you know planned cities now exist in places like Chandigarh, Islamabad but Faisalabad itself is known for being a uh, planned city. In fact from the clock tower if you look up, if you do Google, Google Earth, Google map search, from the clock tower if you look up there is the flag of the Union Jack which you'll see because all the bazaars point at various angles and they make up the Union Jack and Faisalabad itself was a planned city uh, and from day one it was planned and that's what you'll see if you go there but just at James Broadwood Lyles cemetery here today it's pouring down with rain it's cold it's wet um, I'm soaked through but these are the kind of things that you put yourself through when you are on the hunt for more links uh, towards uh, things that are of interest to me which is mostly anything that's Indian and Pakistan related uh, there's a lot of things in the UK itself which um, I've been going through and which I will continue to go through and I'll uh, bring to you in the near future